So in a recent video, we were using the shops with miter pro. It's a specialized miter gauge of sorts, miter gauge, <laughs> used to cut only 45 degree angles in order to get a 90 degree corner on things such as picture frames. Works fantastic on the shopsmith. Question came up, well, how does that compare to what Rockler is now selling as their 45 degree miter sled? So I bought one, thought, let's find out. My first concern was, would it even fit? And yes, it's raining here. Would it even fit the miter slots of the shopsmith? Yes, kinda sorta, however, the bar is thicker than the depth of the shopsmith miter gauge slot. So it's wanting to teeter. And in fact, when it's sitting down, it's sitting at an angle. So maybe, maybe you can file or hit that with a hand plane if you like. Uh, but then we have another problem. Let me move, let me move you so you can see the other problem. Now you're looking straight at the saw and you'll notice the problem. Uh, to use this, it's going to cut off the tip of that tool. Um, should we just go ahead and do it? No, we're not going to go ahead and do it. Normally, normally I like being destructive like that, but because it isn't sitting flat in the miter slot, it's not going to work. Okay, so what could we do to make this work? The first one is, as I said, uh, maybe you just go ahead, you, you let it cut the nose off, and you take a little bit off the face of this. You do have little adjustable nylon tipped set screws that would allow you to tighten this up for your miter gauge slot. Uh, another possible solution for this would be to make a sub cable that mounts to this cable, not unlike what I did on the joint Matic. That would allow us with a table that's mounted on top of this one to have a groove that acts as our miter slot far enough back to where we are clearing that edge. In fact, we would cut a three quarter inch by three eighths inch through, and it would be just the same as anybody else's miter gauge. Uh, unfortunately, at 5.30 a.m. tomorrow, I fly out of Greensboro to San Juan, Puerto Rico, and I don't have time to do this. So I'm disappointed too. In the meantime, I'm gonna link down below to a video or two where this tool is being used, and we'll circle back around and try some of those solutions again soon. Make it a great week.